Hello everyone and welcome to Eye on Heraldry. Today's topic is gonna be the history, evolution, and meaning behind Russia's coat of arms or emblem. The story starts in 1472 when Ivan III or Ivan the Great, yes that's the same Ivan who kicked the Tatars and Mongols from Moscow and expanded the current Kremlin, uh, Ivan adopted the first coat of arms in 1472 as his seal when he married a Byzantine princess and adopted the Byzantine double-headed eagle as his own seal. That seal remained in use until it was later changed twice under the reign of his grandson Ivan IV or Ivan the Terrible, uh, most noticeably to add Saint George and the Dragon in 1589, uh, which is currently used as the Moscow coat of arms. The next change happened in 1654 when the scepter and orb were added to the eagle's claws as well as a third crown. That same general design of a black double-headed eagle remained in use till the fall of the Russian Empire and the rise of the uh, Soviet Union with minor changes over the next two to three hundred years. Then after that we get the Soviet Union emblem that changed and kept changing since it was adopted in 1923 till the fall of the Soviet Union. And to be honest, that one needs its own video, which I will get to at a later time. After the fall of the Soviet Union, in 1993, President Boris Yeltsin signed a decree to replace the communist design by, a present, by the present day coat of arms, which is derived largely from the imperial eagle, uh, but it changed its colors from black to golden and removed the imperial blue ribbon as well as the collar of uh, the Order of St. Andrew. As you can see, the eagle has retained its imperial uh, crowns and they still remain on the coat of arms as of today. But today the imperial crowns on each head stand for the unity and sovereignty of Russia, both as a whole and as its own republics uh, and regions. The orb and scepter grasped uh, in the eagle's talons are traditional heraldic symbols of sovereign powers and authority they have retained uh, those in the modern Russian arms, despite the fact that the Russian Federation is not a monarchy. And with that, I would like to see your opinion on the Russian coat of arms. What do you think about it? And which one of the older ones do you like best and why? Uh, I would also like to invite you to subscribe to Eye on Heraldry uh, YouTube channel if you enjoyed this video, so you can get the later ones. Uh, and thank you for watching.